Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to another quick tutorial from Joel. And today's video is going to be about how can we install plugins in Adobe Photoshop CC 2017. Because it seems that the new version of Photoshop doesn't allow to install another plugins. So I found a way with a installer that it's fast and quick and easy to do it so let's go ahead and start to do it so I'm gonna put the links on the description so you can download it so the first thing we're gonna do uh, I'm gonna go ahead and install CXP installer I'm gonna download for OS and if you're in Windows you can download for Windows I haven't tried doing it in Windows but I think it will be the same so click on download for Mac OS. So let's go ahead and open it. Let me close this. Let's go ahead and drag this to the application folders. Um, this happened because I already installed it, so it's fine. So I'm gonna just click replace. Okay, so when it's done, I'm gonna go ahead and open my the, the application. Okay, so we we'll click open, and that's it. Um, you already have the Adobe installer. So now what you have to do, if you have already your CXP file, you just drag the file over here. So I'm gonna go ahead and download a plugin that I want to install to Photoshop which is called Splash Holder it's a plugin from the website on Splash basically on Splash is a website where you can get free stock footage for a project so I'm gonna go ahead and install it you don't have to do this you can just go ahead and skip this part so it's okay so I'm gonna go ahead and click click download Okay, I want to do a retweet because that's how they want me to pay them with a shout out. Okay, I'm going to click access and that's it. It already downloaded. I'm going to go ahead and look it up in the finder. And I'm going to close this, close this, and let me open this too. Okay, so I have here the file, so I'm going to go ahead and drag it to the CXP installer. It's going to request me for a password. So, as you guys can see, um, it says your extension has been installed. Please restore your Adobe application. So, I'm going to go ahead and open Adobe Photoshop. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and create a new file. I'm gonna go ahead and do I'm gonna do a UI for mobile. I'm gonna select the iPhone 6, create. And now guys, you can go ahead and go to your Windows. I already have it here because I already um, installed it. So I'm gonna go for you guys that are new, just go ahead and go to Windows, extensions, and you will see your extensions or plugins over here already. So just go ahead and click on it and it will appear on your right sidebar so guys um thanks for watching this video i hope it helps you and if you have another ideas for me to do a tutorial please go ahead and subscribe to my channel and comment below so i can know which kind of tutorial i can do on the future guys uh, peace out